Hey, fun size users. Are you looking to make your button on your site pop out just a bit more? I had a user uh, message me earlier about um, he had taken the, the headline for his site. He actually he created it in Canva and he wanted it to uh, extend completely across the, the full width of the screen on mobile instead of having a little bit of white padding off to the left and the right on mobile. So I showed him how to do that, but I noticed that uh, the background color that he had put in the Canva image that he had used for his headline matched exactly with his button. And I suggested that he change the color of the button. Uh, you don't want the button to match um, something else significantly on your page because then your user could get confused and not know that this is a button that they need to submit. But uh, when I made that suggestion to him, I wanted to share that with you guys, but I also shared with him, and I want to share this, you can drop in a little bit of code to give your button some shadow so that this really pops out on the page. So let's go ahead and do that real quick. So I'm going to go into, I could add it in uh, in a code block or I can put it into the settings block. So I'm going to go into settings here real quick and I'll give you this code too in the under the, the video. But you're just going to put in uh, this small snippet of code right here. Let me expand that out a little bit so you can see this. <clears throat> So this snippet of code here is going to put in some shadow in behind the button. Now you can go in and adjust uh, these values that are added in here for the box shadow uh, to adjust uh, like how much shadow shows up and so forth. Um, I'm not actually going to go through that in, in this video here. You can play around with that for yourself. But once we save this, do so I'm going to decrease this because that's bugging me out. I'm going to go ahead and open this up in a new tab and I'm going to show you how that button really pops off the page. So there you go. So now you got that nice shadow really drawing someone's attention into that button. But that's pretty simple. That's all you have to do to make that button have that shadow. You just drop in this snippet of code here. If you've got any questions, let us know.